Hey guys, how's it going? Good to see you again. Um, new camera lens, who dis? Today we're going to be watching some more Legend of Korra, of course. Season 3, we're still early in Season 3, we're on Episode 4, it's called In Harm's Way. The last episode we got to Ba Sing Se, and we met the Earth Queen, and we're trying to get her to help us locate uh, the airbenders that had been detected there, that there have been reports about. Uh, she's being very uncooperative, told us to GTFO. Kai got captured by the Dai Li, and uh, all the other airbenders have been captured as well for like experimentation, I think, or something. Anyways, crazy stuff. Let's see what's going to happen today. Thank you guys for watching and enjoy the video. See you in the comments. And then there's this lady. I would say it does not look like Azula. Too young to be her. It's always a snowstorm heading our way. That's not a snowstorm. That's him. Here we go. We're going to see some awesome bending. I just know it. Oh, her face, her eyes, they look crazy. She looks like she hasn't slept in 20 years. It's probably how I look most of the time. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> I love how creative they get with these, uh, different styles of bending like water benders have different styles of bending they all have their own unique touch let's get you out of here a third eye Zuko's dragon. I've waited 13 years to feel the swarm. Oh, so it's just like combustion man. I thought I'd never see you again. Really? Right now? Well, yeah, they haven't seen each other for 13, at least 13 years. Let him kiss. <laughs> These passports should get you into the upper ring. Awesome. Two, you're the best cousin a guy could have. And my other cousins as well. <laughs> There's so many of you. I love you both. Come visit again. We will, Grandma. I love you too, Grandma. And Chow. <laughs> and two. And Meng Meng. And Chow Jr. And there he is, Big T. And little, little T. And, and medium <laughs> you. And... And, and what was your name again? <laughs> yeah. I know that Earth Queen is lying to me. I can tell by that stupid little queenie smirk of hers. I'm digging the girl bonding here. Mako, Bolin, where have you been? <gasps> we chased Kai, trained, slipped away, lower ring, slept, in trust pile, met her family, grandma tears, Mako scorp, Earth Queen, lying. <laughs> hmm. Can you interpret that? <laughs> I swear the next time I see her, it's the queen. Oh, well, now's your chance, Korra. What you gonna do? Quick, Pabu, shirt! We've received word from the Yang province. There have been reports of airbenders there. Thank you. That is just the most wonderful news. You and your friends here will be leaving immediately. Uh-oh. That's why. Oh, poor thing. He'll see to it that you are on your way by evening. I'm not sure about leaving so soon. So is she trying to send them Earth province, like outside of Bossy say, just to get him out of the city? Guys, what if Kai was spotted airbending? He might have been taken too. Don't worry, Janora. We'll find him. We just need to figure out where to look. I bet they're under Lake Laogai. Could be. Could be. Mako's right. It's the perfect spot to hide airbenders. We're going back to there? I can project my spirit into it. It's not as powerful as it was during Harmonic Convergence, but if I can get close enough, I think I can do it. 
Whoa, that is super useful. You will become the Earth Queen's elite fighting force and protect her at all cost. Go easy on me. I'm not that good. Never show mercy. Now attack your opponent. Aww. I'm not a soldier. You will be when I'm through with you. He's gonna make a man out of you. Mysterious is the dark side of the moon. Better believe it. If anything goes wrong, come back immediately. I will. Look at the fish. Oh, are they not here? It looks filled with water. It's abandoned. It's all flooded. The airbenders aren't there. It's completely deserted. There has to be another way to locate them. Maybe there is. How did you find me during Harmonic Convergence? I think our spiritual connection led me to you. Maybe you can find Kai the same way. I know you two have a connection. Uh, uh. What do you mean, a connection? <laughs> you don't want to know, Dad. <laughs> you don't want to know. Oh, Kai is a... He's a natural. Thanks. Aw, oh, friends. If you have time to help your friend, maybe you're not getting enough rocks for yourself. Oh, oh. Come on. This guy's just on a power trip. I guess you're not as good as you thought. I guess you're a jackass. Throw him in the hole. <clears throat> oh, solitary confinement. Ooh. How are you here right now? Shh, quiet. It's good to see you. We've been looking for you and the other airbenders. Where are we anyway? Underground somewhere. I'll figure it out. Don't worry. Janora. Thanks. The Earth Queen's temple. Oh. It's going to be hard to sneak in there without being noticed. We have to get into that compound tonight and get those airbenders out. Then all we'll need is 12 tons of blasting jelly, a medium-sized bulldozer, and... Does anyone have a badger mole that knows Morse code? <laughs> Everyone, act normal. Hey, Lynn! We need to get Cora out of here immediately. Her life's in danger. Hmm? I just got word from Lord Zuko and Tanra. Oh, right. Zaheer and the others have escaped. Zaheer... Is an airbender now? No. Shortly after we found out you were the Avatar, Zaheer and three others attempted to kidnap you. Luckily, your father, Lord Zuko, Chief Sokka, and Sokka. I were there to stop them. So that's why you and my dad sheltered me away. Oh. To this day, no one knows what their motive was. Now we need to get you back to Republic City where I can protect you. I came here for one thing, to find airbenders, and I'm not leaving without them. And we're busting them out. Let's do it. Yes. Hi. Hey, what are you doing here? You shouldn't be walking around here all alone. I'm not alone. <laughs> Even bummed you. Bumi and Korra, you two will come with me to find the airbenders. You three find Kai. Who are you? I'm the Avatar. And I'm getting you all out of here. You must stay calm and quiet if we want this to work. What to work? Escape. We're sneaking out? Yes. There's an airbender that's not here. His name is Kai. We need to get him. This is Papa Bear. The breezies are in the hold. Cue the balloons. What? <laughs> no one likes code names anymore. Asami and I are on our way. This is so fun. What's that guy's name? The, the friend airbender guy. <laughs> Tens, it's not gonna be happy about this. Bullen, shh. This is too juicy. <laughs> I'm really Bullen. sorry about stealing your wallets and getting you stuck on that train. Yeah, hope you learned your lesson. We can't stay mad at you. Yes, we can. Mako's like, I certainly can. <laughs> Deserting Her Majesty's army is high treason, punishable by death. Wait. Yeah, you can try. Come on, it's clear. Oh, no, it's not. And look at how organized they are. 
These airbenders shouldn't be used as weapons. Taking them will constitute an act of war. They're leaving with me. No, they're not. Oh, the airbender's been training. <laughs> The Dai Li, they don't have experience fighting airbenders. They probably don't really know what to do against some of these moves, right? <laughs> oh no! Get him, Kai! Get him! I guess I am as good as I thought. <laughs> yeah, you tell him. I'm excited for this season because I, I feel like we're going to see a lot of really cool bending and fights and stuff. Especially with these new villains. We've already seen a lot of it. And yeah, it just gets better and better, doesn't it? Bye, Take Queenie. Down those Ooh, that's not good. Where are the others? Whoa. How many hands do they got? <laughs> Everybody, hang on! Ah! That was so cool, Bolin! <laughs> Bring me those airships now! Ah! Ah! <laughs> That's what you get. That's what you get. Ah! We can relocate you somewhere safe, or you can come with me to the Northern Air Temple to live in peace and train as air nomads. What path you decide is up to you. Friend's gonna join the air temple. I want to go with you. Me too. Count me in. I want to go, go too. too. Me too. Oh. I want to go too. Oh, oh Tenzin. Good luck at the Northern Air Temple. His dream is coming true. And Aang's dream too. You did well, Cora. This is only the beginning. <laughs> oh, man, that was beautiful. Oh, they were all saying yes. I'm so excited. Are they all going to shave their heads and get ta arrows tattooed? <laughs> I wonder if they're going, if Tenzin is going to be maybe a little bit more lenient on like the, the nomad lifestyle or if they're just going to like really go all in with like the way it was in the old days. But either way, like, <sighs> you guys know how much I love Tenzin. So that was really nice. I'm excited. And I'm really dying to know that one guy's name, the guy who was like kind of befriending Kai. I'm so, so excited for this season. I'm, I'm excited because like, obviously like the airbenders and stuff, that's super cool. And, um, instead of being Nuck Tuck Bolin's like, you know, fighting with us. And I am most excited about these enemies. They are interesting. Like, I'm really curious to know their backstory, their motives, more about them, seeing their fighting styles more. And also, they just seem really formidable. Like, they seem really scary. And there's a lot of them. And there's a lot of us. So that's that's really interesting, too. We're going to see some really, really cool fights. And Jinora, I'm not sure if she's going to be, m m like, a fighter primarily. But I think it's really cool that she can do all these, like, things that other people can't do with her strong connection to the spirit world and stuff and and she can do like espionage and the out of body thing is really cool and i am super super hyped and emotional from that all right thank you guys um i hope you guys enjoyed i will see you guys in the next episode please let me know what you thought in the comments Bye bye